Welcome lads, we're back for another video. Today we are looking at 80 rated man of the match card Ahmed Hassan plays for SC Braga in the Primera Liga, the Portuguese League and also plays for Egypt. Not the greatest link ups frankly. But looking at his card stats, he's got 65 pace, 81 shooting, 55 passing, 71 dribbling and 81 physical. He's got medium attacking work rates, low defensive. He's got two star skill moves, five star weak foot. His price is pretty decent, frankly, because he's a discard value player. He's a five star weak foot player. Makes someone so much better, in my opinion, than if he could. He's got a pretty powerful shot on him. I, you know, he's a slow player. But he's a big player. is definitely an option with this guy. I gave it a little bit of a try and it was working out okay. But what he can do well, he does well. You know, he shoots and he's strong and he heads. Too many options when it's talking about linking him up. Because, yes, the Portuguese league country just doesn't give the options. But apart from that, he's a very nice little card. Looking at his skill stats, he's got okay ball control at 75, but not the best. Horrible dribbling at 72. Really nice finishing though at 84. Great heading accuracy at 89. Okay long shots at 73. Uh, and his shot power is not the best at 82. Short passing at 65. Horrible long passing at 49. He doesn't really fit the bill for my style of a striker. Because I like a striker that can pass the ball. But apart from that he's very good. He's got a powerful shot. He can kind of hit it from distance. Not the best long distance shooter, but he scores goals. And I just love a striker that doesn't mess around, who's clinical, because you're not going to get many chances in this game, frankly. Players play in such weird ways defensively. They just back off, back off, ultra defensive, part the bus. So to have a striker that just puts the ball away is something I personally really like. Now, looking at his physical stats... Doesn't have the best attacking positioning, even though I thought his movement was, it was good. It wasn't amazing. He's got 62 acceleration, 67 sprint speed. That's not good at all. I thought he was a bit quicker than that. Not so sure about those stats. He's got 83 strength. I talked about that, you know. It kind of makes up for his slow uh, ability, because he's got horrible agility as well at 60, that he's just so strong. He just pushes defenders away. And that really works out well for him. The stats are okay, frankly. His finishing stat is probably the best option out there. He can definitely uh, head the ball with also not the greatest jumping, truth be told, at 56. So that's not the best. But, you know, any kind of stat... If he's dead on the head of it, the fact of the matter is he don't need to jump because he's six foot three. You know, the players with the high jumping stats generally are shorter who come flying out of the air. Now, let's move on to some in-game highlights. As we can see here, he picks the ball up in his own half. And the defenders are just backing off him here. Here he gets kind of lucky, gets through, opens up the space. They're just backing off him, no problem. But he doesn't quite get that one in. I mean, his long shots aren't the best. Here he gets through and ah, he just should have been burying that, really. I mean, that's the kind of area that this guy should be scoring. I wouldn't say he's an inconsistent finisher because... Those were not, you know, amazing chances. Definitely against a good goalkeeper. You're probably not going to score it. But the weak foot. I mean, that's the thing that I love the most about this player. Was his ability to shoot right foot, left foot, no problem whatsoever. He was just going on a bit of a run. Yes, the two-star skill moves are a huge letdown. I just hate two-star skill moves. But then he pulls something like that out of the bag. And it's like, I don't care about your two-star skill moves. I mean, because my constant skill moves that I use a lot, the ball roll and the kind of advanced body feint variation, are both two-star skill moves. So I'm not generally too concerned about that, but just a five-star weak foot, man. Just so good. Here he just goes on a lovely little one-two, puts it into the back of the net. Anyways, that's the end of this video. i got to give this player a 7 out of 10 because of the skill moves, but make sure to drop a like. Drop a comment, follow me on Twitter, at FIFA Wisdom, and make sure you subscribe so you catch all my videos. And I'm out. Bye-bye.